Dia Walker and I am an instructor for the College of Education, the Department of Leadership and Teacher Education for uh, the University of South Alabama, uh, Baldwin County campus. And our class meets at the Fairhope campus and we enjoy being in this community. We enjoy going to class near the schools where we are assisting teachers and getting first-hand classroom experience with children. Uh, my students like being able to stay after class and ask questions. And sometimes the questions aren't just about education curriculum. Sometimes it's about how to balance work and outside commitment and all the things that good teachers do. Many of our students work in the community uh, in different businesses. Two of my students are managers of major retail stores in Baldwin County, and yet they attend classes at the Fairhope campus, and two days a week they're in the schools teaching and guiding reading groups and doing all the things that we want them to do to be good teachers of reading and math and science and social studies. That is the sequence curriculum that they're doing in this semester, preparing for student teaching. The degree program is an elementary education degree. Our students will be certified in the state of Alabama to teach in grades one through six in all areas of the elementary curriculum. We focus on reading, math, science, and social studies in this sequence because those are the major content areas for the Alabama courses of study. Many of our student teachers go right into a uh, classroom. This is their sequence this semester. Then these students will student teach in the fall of 2009, and they will be ready to take over a classroom January of 2010. The atmosphere of learning in the classes at Fairhope, the Baldwin County campus, is open to inquiry, open to conversation. We deal with the real problems that our students face in the classroom. We have dialogue. We meet in small groups. We have whole group conversations about what it is to take on the responsibility of actually teaching other people's children. We are, in essence, preparing them to educate other people's children and what a huge responsibility that is for teachers today. With all the information available, what guides our focus? What guides our practice? What engages our students in real life learning? There's so much technology available. There's so many outside interests that the children are constantly distracted by how do we help kids focus on learning the most meaningful things in our classrooms that will prepare our children for the future. And our, and our students are very, very wise about that. Uh, they want to know the real thing. Uh, and we appreciate them making us better as instructors by asking real life questions.